Morning by Morning by Charles Haddon Spurgeon, March 25th. Betrayest thou the Son of Man with a kiss? Luke 22, 48. The kisses of an enemy are deceitful. Let me be on my guard when the world puts on a loving face, for it will, if possible, betray me as it did my master with a kiss. Whenever a man is about to stab religion, he usually professes very great reverence for it. Let me beware of the sleek-faced hypocrisy which is armor-bearer to heresy and infidelity. Knowing the deceivableness of unrighteousness, let me be wise as a serpent to detect and avoid the designs of the enemy. The young man, void of understanding, is led astray by the kiss of the strange woman. May my soul be so graciously instructed all this day that the much fair speech of the world may have no effect upon me. Holy Spirit, let me not, a poor, frail son of man, be betrayed with a kiss. But what if I should be guilty of the same accursed sin as Judas, the son of perdition? I have been baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus. I am a member of his visible church. I sit at the communion table. All these are so many kisses of my lips. Am I sincere in them? If not, I am a base traitor. Do I live in the world as carelessly as others do, and yet make a profession of being a follower of Jesus? Then I must expose religion to ridicule and lead men to speak evil of the holy name by which I am called. Surely, if I act thus inconsistently, I am a Judas, and it were better for me that I had never been born. Dare I hope that I am clear in this matter? Then, O Lord, keep me so. O Lord, make me sincere and true. Preserve me from every false way. Never let me betray my Savior. I do love thee, Jesus. And though I often grieve thee, yet I would desire to abide faithful even unto death. O God, forbid that I should be a high-soaring professor and then fall at last into the lake of fire because I betrayed my master with a kiss.